high so the new area that land is kinda out and he starts to explore it and yeah he just enjoyed the video alright we're starting off with this area I think it's one of the starting areas with Katina and since I've speedrun this there's just going to be no downtime whatsoever Miss. and I missed the Ocula great what a great start to our exploration and here is pine level number 189 properly nope I was close it's only like what 57 ish off which definitely equals to 189 don't ask me why and also I'm just kind of going with a really fast team Bolani, Yelan, Kajina I put Alka here just for um, emotional support I definitely didn't need her DPS Oh cool I think this is the first getting recipes in Yes Is it good that Mulan is dead? Okay This is getting quite annoying I think I'm just going to kill my boyfriend in Victoria first because I definitely need more overt power. Nice. Okay, here's some cool tech that I can do. Nope. 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 Okay, here's some cool tech that we couldn't do. But here's some cooler tech that I could do. Um, where am I? What on earth even just happened? I guess we just fight this properly. Even though I kind of forgot how to parry already. I think I need to watch more. I parry everything. Because that guy somehow manages to parry an entire Minotaur's eyes straight into his head. First of all, I just want to say, ow. Second of all, ow could I? Yay. Third of all, new CD, even bigger yay. And fourth of all, random chest, even bigger yay. I just stole all of their food for a second time today. And I also stole the beam balls. Nice. I'm actually really glad I pulled Bulani though. Since I could just serve. And here we go. Falling Drake in the hole. Bruh. As I was saying, we're drawing Drake in the hole. Like the chasm. Except Musulani is dead. Again. I actually really like this area a lot. This me kind of feels like in Browser's Castle. For Mario. Except that we're just not Mario and which is a random girl with a surfing board. Oh, no way. Level 3 Mulani. Easy, I don't know how many XP people save. Great, I got a B. Just like what I get in my exams. I definitely have to get an S or something if I need to get the full boss. This is actually so much easier with her. I actually don't need to use that dinosaur. <laughs> and easy, yes. I wish my grades are that easy to get. I actually had to try hard there, which sucks. What happened? Um. I've no idea how that even died. Hello? He just dropped the chest out of him. Another one. I don't want to try and bomb her. Like with the other one. It will be funny. Yeah, got her. I actually really like these kind of series. They're so much better than the old ones since. Bye bye. They can walk. Never mind. They can walk on air. This actually kind of reminds me of that one Pokemon Sun and Boon 
Infinity game. I think it was the joke one. <laughs> I don't know, for some reason that was really funny. Okay. An easy SS. Oh, enough to play around. <laughs> Let me just try this place. Psych! And I think this should be the final waypoint. Yep, we're scaring the Scorching Mountains. Fight! Okay. Yeah, them! The 900 damage and 1000 damage is going to kill it so easily. Without even my health. And thanks to the dinosaurs, we've successfully infiltrated Jurassic World. And we got 40 people gems for it. I think it's time to just clear the shroud of deaths. We're achieving all the power lockless. Just get the keys first. And actually, I didn't realize, but they actually give so much free more gems now from Death of 7. We can also give all our power sigils to this Tornas flame, even though this doesn't really look like a flame, more like a tablet. I think it's trying to play like Indiana Jones, like Lost Down. And actually, this and wow, these give three more gems for each level. I'm kind of tempted to claim them, but I'm not. So now, let me just focus on opening off every fun of this. Then, we should have the final percentage. Now this is a big one. We are currently 95%. So if this fun of death doesn't give me like 5%, I don't know what to do. Then... I'm pretty sure I've gotten every single chest already. Alright, moment of truth. Did I successfully get 100%? Or did I mess up and only got like, what, 99%? Survey says... GP Rocks. And our show time. Alright. Thank you so much for watching this video. As per usual, here are my results. We've gotten like around 3000 ish people gems from what I initially started, which is actually pretty nice considering that I didn't add extra ones from Dao, which would give the like probably an extra 160. <laughs> but, anyways, I'm really happy that I got to finish 100% Netland before I opened my semester. Now I don't need to worry about not having a 100% map, even though it doesn't really matter at all. I just thought it would be nice. The exploration is fun anyways. And yeah, I'm going to say it again. Thank you so much for watching this video. Maybe see you in the next one. And goodbye.